recharge my electric vehicle. Whenever people talk about electric vehicles, they always have the same question. Where do I charge it? It's actually very easy, as you can charge electric vehicles almost anywhere these days. Whether it's using your own Mercedes-Benz wall box at home, at work, at a Mercedes-Benz dealer, at a highway rapid charging station such as Ionity, one of Europe's most powerful rapid charging networks, or on a public car park. How do you find these charging stations? It's simple. With EQ optimized navigation, you'll be taken to one in no time. When you come to a public charging station, just use your customer card, the app, or the MBUX multimedia system in order to authorize and just connect your vehicle to it. Payment is made automatically via Mercedes Me Charge. Then you can go about your day. Interesting fact. Charging cables and plugs now follow international standards. Let's take Europe for example. Here you can charge your vehicle more or less at every public charging station in any country. The Mercedes Me app informs you that your vehicle is fully charged by means of a push notification. Meaning you don't have to worry about a thing. When you get home at the end of the day, you can just plug the vehicle back into the Mercedes-Benz wall box. Did you know that our charging partner's installation service can mount the wall box for you? It's easy, and they can also give you advice about our home charging solutions. How much time does my electric vehicle take to charge? A recurring question regarding electric vehicles is, how long does it take to charge? The answer is simple. It depends on different factors. One of them being whether you are using AC or DC. AC means alternating current. This is the electricity that you usually get from the outlets in your home. It is also used for your Mercedes-Benz wall box and at most public charging stations. Here, the charging capacity is commonly up to 22 kilowatts. As the battery actually can only accept DC, direct current, there is an onboard charger inside every vehicle. This charging device converts the alternating current to the direct current, which is suitable for the battery. DC also facilitates a short period of rapid charging with high performance. The trick is that with DC, the conversion of electricity from AC to DC already happens at the charging station. This means that more performance is available, and more performance means shorter charging times. There are special rapid charging stations for this. In Europe, for example, Ionity is creating an entire network of charging stations that can provide a charging capacity of up to 350 kilowatts. You can find these on European highways. Plus, the charging times also depend on the size of the battery. This means that the larger the battery, the further you can drive on one single charge. In turn, the charging also takes longer. What influences the range of my electric vehicle? The question is often asked as to how far you can travel in an electric vehicle. It's actually further than most people think. Plus, you can rarely answer this question with just a number. There are a variety of factors that play a role in it. Alongside battery capacity, the ambient temperature and your own driving style, for example, have an effect on the range. The good thing is, though, that you don't have to worry about any of these factors. There is an infrastructure in place that makes it possible to charge your vehicle almost anywhere, meaning you can travel longer distances with nothing to worry about. Now, nothing can stand in the way of your next long journey. A well-deserved holiday, perhaps.